my colleague, my seatmate, my friend, Hans Iger. This will help to get me reelected so everyone knows for good that I'm a Republican and I'm from Puyallup. And we in this rising generation are inheritors of a mighty legacy. So my great grandparents came out to Washington and they were later school teachers in Puyallup. They wrote these words. All those were gifts, not by government grant, but from love freely shared. And I believe that a free society like that is a heck of a lot better at loving for caring for people than any government bureaucracy ever was. People matter, and sometimes governments forget that. That it was worth going out to 25,000 doorsteps with volunteer help to listen to their concerns. That it was worth mobilizing a team of volunteers to handwrite 18,000 postcards to voters. And that it was worth taking the risk to challenge an entrenched incumbent. Well, as you know, we won the last election in a landslide, and I've been thinking that, <laughs> I've been thinking that I'd like to uh, double my lead this year, which means we should win by 58 votes. And you know, Really, public service is a kind of ministry. You laugh with your neighbors and you cry with them. You have plenty of occasions to pray because you're presented with plenty of problems and you have plenty of occasions to rejoice because you see all the time that free people are capable of amazing things. And then you're inspired about what we might yet accomplish together. Having a term behind me, I look forward to working on some achievable goals. First, to work toward a state budget that's sustainable and prioritized, making education, public safety, and care for the most vulnerable our highest priorities. To reform our bureaucracy, to make government less costly and less burdensome to our businesses. To extend Highway 167 from Puyallup onto the Port of Tacoma uh, and bring new jobs to our area. To relieve congestion on Meridian by building the Cross Base Highway and other improvements to roads on South Hill. <laughs> and to make our system of public higher education more accessible, affordable, and market-driven. I look forward to working with a Republican majority in the legislature after November. I look forward to working with Senator Bruce Dammeyer. I look forward to working with Representative Shelley Schlumpf. And I look forward to working with Governor Rob McKenna. So I hope that you will continue to hold me accountable and to remind me of the enduring principles that we hold in common. Thank you so much for being here tonight.